Yeah, well, this search has certainly been a very grueling and dangerous search. Uh, they are about 30 minutes away from the original spot they were over the weekend, so it's definitely quite a distance, but that also tells you just how large this area really is. It is over 24,000 acres. It's massive, but officials say they plan on doing their best to search as much of it as possible to find laundry. The search was called off yesterday, and we're not really sure why it's back on today, but they went all in. Help from the FBI, Northport PD, Sarasota County Sheriff's Office, Lee County Sheriff's Office, and other agencies combining their resources to aid in the search. The challenge here is they are dealing with an area that is 75% underwater, and in some parts, it's waist deep. In those areas, they are taking drones and helicopters in the air to search. In parts where they can walk, they're using canines and all-terrain vehicles to look, and they're certainly determined to find Brian Laundry. And the reason they're looking here is because this is the park his parents say he went to last Tuesday. They didn't report that information until Friday. We're not sure why they waited as long as they did. Northport PD says they didn't have eyes on him since he was only a person of interest. You could have placed a surveillance team on him or, or, or at least maybe two vehicles, unmarked vehicles, to follow him wherever he might go. But I guess the decision was made not to do that. Maybe in hindsight, that was a mistake. And we still have a lot of agencies out here. We're not sure how much longer they're going to remain out here, when they're going to conclude the search for the night, or if they're going to be back here tomorrow. All of that is information we're hoping to learn within the next you know, few hours. For now, we're live in Sarasota County. Heather Lee, ABC Action News. Heather.